The migration of applications from dedicated data centers into the cloud is essential to succeed with a cloud-centric digital strategy now and in the future. One of the challenges itself is the planning as many factors come into play. The other challenges lie in adapting to strict security requirements, but also moving large volumes of data into the cloud, as our AEM installations are usually quite big. In general, we have two options of migrating. We can perform a one-to-one -one migration, or we can execute a delta migration, which will come into play if the repository is quite big, or we require short periods of a content freeze. For Amazon Web Services-based migrations, we can use S3 Transfer Acceleration or the Services Storage Gateway. This helps us in migrating large volumes of data much quicker into the cloud. As a principal system engineer at Netcentric, I build, let's say, bulletproof migration plans. Even when we encounter any technical challenges during the migration, I apply out-of-the-box thinking to ensure any challenges are mitigated. Actually, I apply out-of-the-box thinking to almost anything I do in life, including my hobby, working and restoring old cars. Migrating AEM to the cloud is much like swapping an engine. You need to really think about all the different components that come into play. Every small detail need a lot of engineering and also a bit of craftsmanship. Let's talk about migrating Adobe Experience Manager into the cloud 